Hello and welcome to the channel. My name is Corey with Skinny Fat Duck. Uh, today we are checking out Kena Bridge of Spirits. Or Kena, or we're checking out something Bridge of Spirits. Um, this is a game that I'd heard about on a couple of Game of the Year things last year. And I finally uh, got around to looking at it now. Pretty doggone cool. I'm not gonna lie. Um, I did nothing. Kind of reminds me of Pikmin. If you guys played that any. Um, you play as this lady with uh, her little buddies. Called the Rot. But they don't really look all that rotten. It's kind of weird. But let's go talk with these guys. to drop the targets. See if you can hit them before they reset. Oh, probably not. Alright, so do you use the rot to do varying things? Oh, nice. So they help you solve uh, different puzzles and that sort of stuff. Hit these targets. Make a make make day. But anyway, the game's got a uh, very cool art style. I think. Um, graphically, it's neat. Like, I really like the way it works. I will stay, uh, say, excuse me, I'm still a little confused as to what I'm actually supposed to be doing here. Um, it's a, uh, it's a cool game with some nifty ideas, but like the story portion of it, I don't know his act, if that's actually given me anything that I can really latch on to and understand. Now I will readily admit maybe it's uh maybe it's a me thing. I don't know. But with that being said, I would not hesitate to recommend this to pretty much anybody. So you have the rot, you have this little like I don't know, pinging stuff thing that doesn't seem to do that much all the time. Manifestations of corruption patrol the path ahead. Your bow should help clear the way. Okay. So, combat is around little baby Groots. Like evil Groots. Um, and usually, ah, uh, usually there's something to, crap. Oh, no, 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 no. Get back on there. Thank you. Um, usually there's something to clear off. Okay, that clearly doesn't do anything. Alright. 
Oh, that'll work. So yeah, you'll go through and fight some bad guys. You will open up one of those flowers. You'll throw the rod at them. And then it'll make the place look better. Then you solve the puzzle. So... Anyway, it's kind of rinse, wash, repeat on this, uh, the boss battle. I've had one boss battle thus far that's been, uh, oh, excuse me, pretty challenging. I won't lie. This broken path leads to my house. The corruption there is powerful. Be careful, Kana. Um, not like a completely... Or not like a Souls game, Elden Ring kind of way. It was. But it definitely had a bit of challenge. Oh, wow, look at that. Oh, I can rest here and center myself and permanently increase my maximum health. So let's do that. Nice. All right. We did it. So, can I shoot back up there? That's kind of cool. I just unlocked the... Uh, Just unlocked the bow recently. So, knowing what it does. It's not my strong suit. Oh, alright, well, I screwed that up. Alright, let's fight some corruption dudes. Oh, you might get to see me do a bit of a boss battle here. Now what? Alright, any more dudes? Oh. Alright. Ow, God. Oh, I'm in the... I'm in the yucky stuff. Crap. Crap. Ah. Ah. Uh. Nice. Yeah. So I did kind of poorly there. You may now see why my original my original video game presence online was under the moniker Old Man is Bad at Gaming. It's because I'm no good, but that's fine. I enjoy it, and that's what matters. Oh yeah, you got masks, apparently, to see and do different things. I only have one at this point, and I hadn't really done much with it, so. I made that knife for Taro when he was a boy. 
He loved these woods, and I tried my best to teach him the old ways, consumed by the troubles of our village. I was not there for Taro when he needed me most. I hope we can bring him peace. More relics are hidden in the corruption of the Forgotten Forest. I'll wait for you there. Thanks, Eagle Guy. Hey. Right, let's go look around his house. Oh, we found more rot. The rot can now perform more actions. There's another rot. I see, it's weird that they call them rot. They're like little... Cute things. But hey. Right there. To each their own, I guess. Get that. All right. See where we go next. Let's go this way. Now ah, let's go talk with the kids. It's good to be back. Yeah, I wish Taro was here. All right. So Taro is their brother. That's who we're out trying to find at the moment. Uh, excuse me. All right. So where does that go? I feel like that goes up here somewhere. I mean, that looks about right, doesn't it? I've already been in that cave. So I don't rightly know. I don't know. Maybe I'm doing that incorrectly. Have I been in here? Yeah, I have been in here. Alright. So yeah, the only issue that I've had with this game thus far... Um, been a couple little technical things. Nothing too major. Uh, but just, you know... Some stuff that made it... A bit more challenging to do. Alright, so we came across there. Let's go back this way. Alright, I know where we're at now. Um, every once in a while I've gotten hung up on something. It's only happened once or twice. But, uh, it was not my favorite. Uh, is that moving that? Come on. Right there. Maybe I gotta keep flipping them around. Yep, take it up there. 
Uh, but yeah, got hung up on like a treasure chest or something like that. And, but it's happened pretty rarely. So it hadn't been exactly that. It's not anything to like freak out about. I like. It. I think it looks super good. Um, I like the graphics. You can get little hats for your buddies. Um, all kind of things. All right, we're gonna go this way just to see if there's anything. Oh, hey. We got us another little buddy. I just feel weird calling those things rot. But we do have a new rot hat available. So we got that going for us. Alright. Let's throw the dude in there. So you basically use this to do different kind of puzzles and that sort of stuff. Ah, oh, crap. I didn't mean to hit that. All right, well, let's go back and do that again, I guess. There we go. Nice. Got more of those two hickeys. So, you got your map, you got different upgrades that you can uh, do. Yeah, sure. Oh, crap. I got that mixed up. I was looking at the wrong thing. All right. Well, we've committed to that one. All right. So we came out of here. Let's go up here. Well, Nice. We did it. We did it. You cannot stop me. I'm invincible. I'm sorry, I don't know what that is. But anyway. This is it. This is Kena, Bridge of Spirits. Um, I believe it's still a PlayStation exclusive, and you can get it on the Epic Game Store. I don't think it's on Steam, but uh, anyway, it's a pretty relaxing game, and that's uh, kind of what I was looking for. So I'm. Uh, I'm digging it a whole lot. So, if you were so inclined, you should check it out. If you're not, then, you know, I guess don't do that. You know. Whatever you want to do, I guess. 
Okay. I see now. I think I see what they're wanting me to do. Anyway, this is it. This is the game. Um, this is kind of what we do here. We play video games and we say things that aren't that interesting. So if you like what you've seen, give us a like. Consider subscribing. Thank you for watching. We will see you next time. Oh, that was cool. All right. Bye.